Hi everyone and welcome back. So in this video we are going to talk about modules. So first of all we will try to understand Node.js modules and module pattern. So in JavaScript world you might have seen uh, you might have seen the modules being imported something like this. Import module from module name right like simple if I give you the example of simple react it has nothing to do with the client side or server side module it can be anywhere so react right so this is called ES6 way of importing and exporting and while exporting what we do is export this function like I created a you can just say export const say hi Right, this can be another constant which you are exporting from the line itself and then you are importing it somewhere else. So if I wanted to import it from this particular file, then I will just do import say hi from this particular file and this file can be anywhere index right. So this is how we actually export and import things you can also to export a default some function oh man some function right and then you can import it later in another file something like import because it's a default export so import x from this index if you are doing a named export then you have to put a braces there because you are selectively exporting importing that here you are exporting only single thing from the file so you can import it like this so this is a ES6 way of import export which we are calling right you can also use it with the node.js but what you have to do is you have to just compile it with the babel because in node.js currently ES6 module import export are not supported even in the latest version of node.js which is 14 and all you can use a Babel register to compile it or if you are comfortable then you can use a node.js with the TypeScript because the TypeScript transpiler will be able to compile this ES6 way of import export if you are writing plain JavaScript with node.js then you can use this common JS way of import export so this is called common JS module pattern where we are doing export and import so here from this code what we are doing is we are exporting this function right and uh, we are exporting two things my function and my string and here we are importing them my string so module 1 and module 2 right this module 1 and module 2 has all these functions so my function it, here we are exporting my function and my string here also we are exporting so there are many ways of writing it so either you can write it like this here also we are exporting my function and my variable here also we are exporting my function and my variable so here we just brought them splitted way otherwise you can just extract everything in the module.exports module.exports here whatever you wanted to export you can wrap it here like if you already created some function then just put a function name or variable name or anything whatever is available so once you are exporting from here so just remember this keyword module.exports it is with s okay and here we are just need to do require so this is common JS way of exporting and importing things in your node.js files because obviously you are not going to write whole logic in one file there will be app.js middleware.js routes.js all these different files will be there and here there you will be exporting and importing in this files okay this is the first example we covered about which is talking about how you import and export what are different module patterns es6 module amd umd common js we just more mostly talk about common js and es6 module patterns only